Welcome. Today's topic is how to read a tape measure. We recommend using a 25 foot Stanley power lock tape. For our type of work, they are the easiest to use and have a one inch wave blade which keeps it rigid. In our work, it's usually best to read a tape in feet and inches rather than just inch inches. For example, you read three foot four inches rather than 40 inches. There are, of course, 12 inches in every foot. So 12 inches equals one foot, 24 inches equals two foot, and so on. Inches of most tapes are divided into halves, quarters, eighths, and sixteenths. You can see the lines, and right here and right here are the inch marks, so they go all the way up. This one is the half inch mark and it goes halfway up. The quarter inch marks go quarter high. And then you have the eighth inch, they're the next highest, and then the smallest are sixteenths. There are times when you need to measure an object, but it's like if I want to make measure in between my hands here. You can roll the tape, but you don't get an accurate measurement. So the best way to measure in between two things is to do it like this. So in between my hands, I've got the back of the tape. And so if it reads right there, eight inches, I simply add three inches, which is the distance here. So that 8 inches would have been 11 inches. So those are the basics of tapes. They're pretty easy. I'm sure you'll get it figured out. But good luck to you and see you again next time.